All right, what is going on folks? Russian Otaku back here on the Fortune 4 Shooters Channel back with another video. It is a really nice Monday afternoon, so figure I'd make this video. I did a short earlier. You know, I'm just still on my way to the store here. I'm just out walking, enjoying the breeze. Nice breeze, not too hot, sunny day. Doesn't look like it's gonna rain, no clouds out. So it looks like it's gonna be a nice day, man. So I can take my time about walking here and just enjoying the outdoors, you know. You know. <laughs> Um, but anyway, so I want to make this video because um, we have a little shout out to the other members of the Fortune 4 Shooters. Welcome on to the group. And like I said before, like I mentioned before, the Fortune 4 Shooters are now stronger than ever now that we've absorbed and taken in some of the members of the Ambiguous Bastards and more members to be revealed soon. But I want to make this video because uh, yesterday, Hero did a video on the channel talking about his favorite anime. And I happened to watch it. Good video, by the way. Decent video. So I figured I'd follow suit and I'd tell you a little bit about some of mine. <clears throat> now, in terms of anime itself, I've been an anime fan, you know, more of a hardcore anime fan since 2005, since, you know, since my junior year of high school, going into my junior year of high school when, when I was 15. But, uh, but yeah, man, I've been a hardcore anime fan, hardcore otaku ever since. And there's been a lot of anime that I've watched in the last almost 20 years now you know since then but even before i became an anime fan i was into anime and it's just as back then i didn't even i didn't really <laughs> quite know what anime was but anyway if you want to talk about favorites <clears throat> shit there's a ton of them dude it would take me a freaking all day to come up with like a list i would have to make i would have to make a literal list just to keep track of them all at one point i actually did have a list there's a couple sites that allow you to do that like for example my anime list uh, dot com. I actually do have an account on there. I haven't logged into it in forever, but in terms of my favorites, and I've done a video of this ilk, you know, I've done a similar video like this on my PR Returns channel, which is my anime channel. If you guys haven't checked that out, be sure to do so, but most of you probably already know about it because I promote it like crazy <laughs> whenever I can. You know, I promote my other channels whenever I can, but in terms of favorites, like I said, I got a lot of favorites. Um, obviously, uh, the anime that really got me into anime, that got me, you know, to become an otaku and started me off, kicked me off as an anime fan, was Naruto when it first aired on Toonami back in 05. A long time Naruto fan, been a long time, you know, anime fan ever since. And it was really Naruto, Nar that, ser that series was the catalyst that uh, got me into anime. And so, and then after that, I started getting into other anime titles, so... But uh, yeah, Naruto is definitely big for me. Um, Naruto, both Naruto and Naruto Shippuden, not so much Boruto, haven't really gotten into that all that much. Um, aside from that, you know, the old favorites, the ones that I was into back in the day when I was younger, you know, obviously the more, you know, kids oriented anime, Pokemon, Digimon, um, Card Captors at one point, Dragon Ball Z was the shit, obviously. Obviously, growing up, Dragon Ball Z was the shit. That theme was fucking badass. Dragon Ball Z! Huh! A rock the dragon dragon you know that same badass theme dude and then um uh, and then also another anime people don't talk a, a lot about nowadays tenshi muyo when it aired on tsunami tenshi muyo was the fucking shit dude tenshi muyo was the fucking shit that was my shit back in the day dude that was the original harem anime <laughs> tenshi muyo was the original harem anime motherfuckers but yeah tenshi muyo is fucking great also gundam wing the gundam series um great shit man you know great mech obviously and it has its history it has its you know multitude of seasons multitude of different series in the gundam in the gundam franchise and all that and aside from that you know later on you had like Yu-Gi-Oh shows like Yu-Gi-Oh um uh there was a show called spider riders that used to air on the wb in, in 2003 2004 not a lot of people know about it but i was a uh, you know I, I enjoyed watching that series when it was around and aside from that in terms of like you know favorites you know modern day favorites uh sekirei there's a series called sekirei that i'm really into i <laughs> that i really loved you know one of my favorite all-time anime titles sekirei um waiting for a season three and I've been hearing word that season three of Sekirei will uh, finally be dropping p potentially next year. Uh, I saw a site, you know, mentioning that. And if it is, if it does, that would be a big fucking deal, man. Because I've been waiting for a season three for Sekirei for fucking forever. Since 2012 when season two dropped. So, but Sekirei was big. Sekirei, great series there. Um, always loved that. Also, Freezing, the series called Freezing. Another, you know, etchy harem fighting, you know, fantasy style anime series there. Really love Freezing. Freezing. Erica 7 was a big one. My favorite mech series of all time, Erica 7. Um, you know, One Piece, Bleach, um, you know, um, 
uh, Black Clover, you know, for more, you know, in terms of more recent anime titles, uh, uh, I Want No Exorcist or Blue Exorcist, uh, let's see, what else, Full Metal Alchemist, uh, you know, <laughs> there's a lot of, like I said, there's so many of them, like, you know, it would take all day, it would take literally all day for me to think of all, <laughs> think of all of them, because there are so many anime I've watched, dude, there are so many that I've, you know, been, fa been, uh, been a fan of, you know, that I've liked, that I've considered a favorite, so, so yeah, there's those titles, and then if we're talking like, you know, more, more, um, more current or anime or anime that have come out recently, um, you know, shows like, uh, uh, Fla uh Fire Force, I'm sorry, Fire Force, Fire Force was, you know, really good series, really solid series. Black Clover, like I mentioned before, um, obviously, you know, Sword Art Online was solid. I know a lot of people kind of, you know, it, that's more of a polarizing series. You know, some people, you know, e either people either like it or they hate it. Same thing with Attack on Titan, and um, and yeah. So let's see what else. Um, and let's see in terms of the anime I've watched recently. You know, my one hit kill sister. I really liked that when it was uh, when it was on when it was Aaron. I got a lot of clips of that on my PR Returns channel. Um, you know, series like titles like that. Titles like uh, let's see what else. Uh, Rent a girlfriend. Another polarizing you know anime title that uh, you know either people people like it or they hate it. Most people hate it. You know, they criticize it, whatever have you, just because of you know. The stupid shit that the main protagonist Kazuya does, <laughs> and, and I've even gotten on him for that shit. But, but yeah, Run a Girlfriend to me is a you know I like it. I, I've enjoyed it up to this point. Um, let's see what else. Uh, gosh, man, there's so many, dude. Like I said, I know I'm leaving some out. I know I'm leaving some out. And by the time I finish this video, I know I'm going to be like, oh man, I forgot to include this one. But, but yeah, there's so many of them, dude. But the main ones, like I mentioned before, you know, Seki Ray. Uh, oh, Air Gear, of course. How can I not mention Air Gear? I love fucking Air Gear. Air Gear is like one of my favorite. That's like top three of my favorite all-time anime titles, dude. Air Gear was the shit, dude. The anime was a bit of a letdown because they didn't include a lot of the stuff that was in the manga. And obviously, people who are fans of Air Gear, Air Gear know what I'm talking about. But Air Gear, Seki Ray, Freezing, the Naruto series. Um, <clears throat> uh, did I say, did I say Eureka 7, Eureka 7, um, you know, Black Clover, Fire Force, you know, Dragon Ball Z, you know, back, way back in the day, and all that, and, uh, yeah, man, so, like I said, I can go on and on, you know, I could, <laughs> there's, a, there's just so many, uh, so many anime titles, I would have to comprise an actual list just to freaking keep track of all of them, I had to have watched at least a good three, four, maybe even 500 anime <laughs> titles in the last 20 years, so that's a lot of shit, that's a lot of anime, that's a lot of titles to remember, so, but anyway, so that's just my list, if you will, my brief list of, you know, favorite anime titles of all time, and ones that I've watched, you know, some that I'm watching right now include, uh, The Duke of Death and His Maid, I just did a, a review of that on my PR Returns channel just last night, um, let's see what else, there's that, there's a series called, um, trying to think of what uh what what titles i'm watching right now there's a there's a series there's one called there's one called there's an isekai there's an isekai that recently came out where like a guy gets reincarnated as like a, a vending machine i'm like <laughs> it's so goofy but but i but i'm watching it like i started watching it's like okay well i mean you know this could be something you <laughs> know like it, it's funny like it's you know obviously just goofy, you know, but it's funny at the same time, so, so there's those two, and then there's, uh, there's a multitude, there's a couple others that I'm watching right now, like I said, I would have to go back and, uh, you know, uh, look up, you know, get, get the names for them, I can't think of them right offhand, but, but anyway, so that's pretty much all I gotta say for that, so that's just my little list of favorite anime titles, just to kind of follow up on what, uh, what Hiroshimaru was, uh, the video that he made, uh, yesterday here on the channel, so, yeah, that's pretty much it for that, so I might do actually a follow-up video of this, and I'm gonna put it more than likely on my, uh, PR Returns channel, so make sure you guys check that out. But anyway, that's all I gotta say for this, so thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, appreciate all the support I can get. Be sure to hit the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified of all my future uploads, because if you don't, you're gonna miss out on some good content. But anyway, that's all I gotta say for now. I'm gonna go, go into the store here, get what I wanna get, 
and then head on home and enjoy the rest of my day. So that's pretty much all I got to say for that. So thank you for watching once again, folks. Till next time, Russian Otaku represent that for us. See you guys later. Another video, more content might be coming later. And I think the guys, you know, the others, other members probably have some videos they want to do. Anyway, till then, Russian Otaku, I'm out. See you guys later.